And you're getting into new spaces. First of all, new worlds with Starfield, but also new, I saw the TV show you're working on. Uh, yep. not, on Fallout with Amazon. Mm -hmm. What's that like? Worlds that you created in the digital realm becoming, going on the screen. Yeah, people asked, you know, I can remember 10 years ago after Fallout 3 was a hit, you know, the movie producers coming and, hey, we think this would make a great movie and taking a lot of meetings. And I think, every, you know, most people would jump at that, like, sweet. Mm -hmm. And I sort of paused and like, I don't know, what is this gonna do? I felt like they're gonna like synthesize. I met great people, like mm -hmm. well-known creatives, like, you know, it's gonna get synthesized into this two hour, I don't know, I'm not, mm -hmm. I'm not seeing the great thing here yet. Mm -hmm. So, you know, I think the advent of television in terms of what it's become, you know, in, in, nowadays with big budget TV series, it kind of came up again and met with people and uh, Jonathan Nolan and Lisa Joy who do Westworld. And mm -hmm. I always love the work he did uh, writing Interstellar and the dark, like movies I just love. Wait, Jonathan Nolan is involved with this? With yeah, he's the, he, yeah, he's the, yeah, he's the EP That's and epic. he's directed Westworld the first. incredible. Yep. Okay, this is awesome. Um, and wow. uh, he, he's, the EPs directed the first few episodes. Um, nice. Done, and, and, and when I connected with him, uh, Jonah was like, hey, you know, you're my, you're the person I want to do this. Yeah. So I met with people, kept saying like, you know, just let me see if he wants to do it. And I was, to my joy, he was like, oh yeah, Fall 3 is one of my, yeah, sign me up. It was like, no, how do we get this done? And at that time he was sort of, he was at HBO and it was, you know, we were trying to figure out it was a, put a little pause on it. Um, and, uh, you know, got to visit the sets, reading scripts and things like that. It's all new to me. Um, but I, they're doing such an incredible job. Like, I think if you like this world, you are going to be just blown away. Some Keep in mind, tone. I've never made a TV show. Right. You know, those are all the best, you know, no one ever does it, uh, wanting it to not be great. But it, they've just done their attention to detail and obsess, they're just obsessive with what's on the screen and the storytelling and how it looks, the whole, the whole thing. Yeah, I think obsession is really uh, a, a prerequisite for greatness. What they did, uh, HBO did with Chernobyl, like the attention to detail is just and, and he's doing uh, The Last of Us now, mm -hmm. that showrunner. If you really care and you really put a lot of effort into the details, you can basically control I was, truly I was stunned. They, they, I mean, I don't want to spoil it, but when people see it, I think you'll just be like, wow. It's the, um, the other thing we're approaching it is very different where when it was, people would say they want to make a movie, they wanted to, you know, tell the story of Fallout 3 or then tell the story of Fallout 4. And for this, it was, hey, let's do something that exists in the world of Fallout. It's not retelling a game story. It's basically, you know, an area of the map and like, let's tell a story here that fits in the world that we have built, doesn't, you know, break any of the rules, um, can reference things in the games, but isn't a retelling of the games that exists in the same world, but is its own unique thing. So it adds to it while also people who don't, haven't played the games, who can't experience like how crazy cool Fallout is, um, can watch the series and so. Yeah. Are there some similarities or interesting differences between the creation of a game and a TV show that you notice from the sort of story perspective? Well, for them, you know, it's much more character driven. Like you can do all these things with the world and stuff that we already have. Um, it's the main characters, who they are, what their motivations are, right. that really is the engine. Right, there's no uh, finding the right actors to do those. Yeah, because yeah. you're not. There's no interaction. There's no. Um, you don't get to enter that world. They have to do the work for you. The NPCs are on the show. 